Well, to draw a pterodon, we need to start with a triangle and maybe a little triangle on the top there as well. And a neck and a body, back legs. Now this is the bit that does it. You want an arm going down there, an arm coming back here and a little bit that flicks back. Then more arm, claws and then a long finger. These are not bats, these are flying reptiles. And that's what makes them different. Okay, bring that down to there. And then we can swoop that back to the legs like that to get that kind of silhouette. Claws, tail, there we go. Let's start here and bring that line around there. We want this top beak to kind of snarl downwards a little bit like that and then flip back on itself. And then they're a bit pelican-like and they've got that kind of throatiness there. And let's put a line down there. That's kind of his top eyelid and that's making him look a bit fierce. Put an eyeball in there. And then sweep that round to these claws. And sweep that round to these claws again. And sweep down to the corners there. And then on this side you can draw a curve around there for its chest. And then draw the rest of the bones in like that. On this one here that will flip back there. And that will come down there and then flick there. That will come round. Tail. Uh, and you want the legs coming down like that with little claws on the end. Like that. Now if you like dinosaurs, go and see my dinosaur playlist. I'll put the link here. There's a and I'm building up as I go along. When you're sure the ink's dry, you can erase the pencil lines. Now we can put some shading in there and it's just, just take your time. This is obviously speeded up and just kind of flick those lines out. And just to suggest the kind of the, the shape and the contour of the wings. And the eyes make them a bit more menacing. Just put dots down at the end. When you need to kind of finish into a fine point, just do them in dots as a suggestion of a line. A little bit of texture. And lots of little dots I'm just putting in, but just more texture really. Make it look a bit more reptilian. And some whoosh marks. And now I'm uh, crayoning in with, um, I think, the Karen Dash watercolour crayons which are nice and soft and uh, shading in one colour and then adding in darker as I'm going and just kind of building up building up the colouring as it goes along now if you really like dinosaurs if you want me to draw lots more then uh, click the thumbs up button uh, so I'll know that you want me to do more of these There we go. Oh, a bit of sky in the background as well. Why not? <laughs> Just to uh, put him up in the air. <laughs> well, if you enjoyed that, why not try drawing a brontosaur? Or maybe try the mystery drawing. Either way, make sure you're subscribed and try my other channel, Draw Stuff Real Easy, for much shorter videos. In the meantime, keep drawing, drawing, drawing. Practice, practice, practice. And I'll see you next time. You take care now.